in the life of the church, Lent is more than a season for giving up. On Ash Wednesday, we were urged to repent, literally to turn, to turn from worldly desires which distract us from doing God's will and turn to God trusting him to lead us in his ways each and every day. But how? One of the key ways to grow in trusting God is through prayer. And one of the most familiar prayers we pray is the Lord's Prayer. But how often do we stop and let God speak to us through the Lord's Prayer? Often we just rattle through it without any thought or thinking. Today, listen to this reflection on the words of the Lord's Prayer and truly turn to God. And may we commit to letting Jesus' will be done in our lives. I cannot pray ah if my faith has no room for others and their needs. I cannot pray father if I do not demonstrate this relationship in my living. I cannot pray who is in heaven if all my interests are in earthly things. I cannot pray hallowed be your name if I'm not striving to be holy. I cannot pray your kingdom come if I'm unwilling to accept God's rule in my life. I cannot pray your will be done if I resent having it in my life. I cannot pray on earth as it is in heaven unless I'm truly ready to give myself to God now. I cannot pray give us today our daily bread if it is withheld from my neighbour. I cannot pray Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us, if I continue to bear a grudge. I cannot pray, lead us into temptation, if I choose to stay in a situation where I shall be tempted. I cannot pray, deliver us from evil, if I am not prepared to fight evil within and without. I cannot pray, yours is the kingdom, if I am not ready to obey its king. I cannot pray, yours is the power and the glory, if I am seeking power and glory for myself. I cannot pray for ever and ever, if I am too anxious about each day's affairs. I cannot pray, amen, unless I can say truthfully, whatever the cost, this is my prayer. Lord, I repent. I turn to you, and I will trust you. Jesus today and forevermore.